Hey guys, it's Chella, and I am going to do a cage tour of my hamster's, my dwarf hamster's cage. So, yeah, let's get started. Um, so this is her cage, and honestly, I do not know how many gallons this would be. So, yeah. So, let's get started. This is basically just made out of a bunch of wood, you know, stuff. So we'll start over here and work our way over. So we have the blue saucer. It's really meant for like Syrian hamsters, but I felt like something small should get something big and also she's spoiled. So, and this is all living things, pink bedding. If you can't tell, it sort of looks orange from my point of view for like, from like my camera. So yeah. Um, this is her water dish, <laughs> water dish, uh, water bottle. Probably wondering, but Chilla, why is that thing way up in the air? Because, first of all, that was supposed to be on Velcro, and we forgot the Velcro when we were building it, and we took it to my house. So we just drilled it on, and yeah. But yeah, it's like a blue water bottle with a turtle inside to see if, to see where my water level is. And yes, there's Velcro on the sides because... When I take her on trips, I have Velcro in an aquarium I have. And here we have Vita Prima um, food and a green food dish. Behind we have a white picket fence. You can get it at like the craft store, like Michael's. Ah, hi. And in the middle here, we have another, we have like a smaller uh, wheel. Where did she go? Oh, there she is. <laughs> and then in the middle here is just like a small, uh, what's it called? <laughs> Bridge. I can't think clearly today. Over here we have like a hay hut, meaning like she can like chew on it. Yeah, you're spoiled. And then we have like a small uh, dwarf sized igloo. It's pretty small. And then here we have a purple Syrian sized igloo. So yeah. And this is basically it. Uh I just cleaned her bedding today, so it was white bedding, but now it's pink. So I like pink. So yeah, anyway. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you in the next one. Bye guys.